All right then. Uh, how does Magical Drop Three sound? God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I already pretty much played a Magical Drop game already. I mean, come on. Well, this one is aesthetically different. Oh, you're right. Because we all know how important that is. Suitable for all ages, but no one underneath the age of 26 will ever be able to get past the second opponent. Laugh as your children cry in frustration. So it's literally Free. the exact same game as the second one, only with even more cruddy animated cutscenes. <laughs> oh like god, this music's <laughs> hideous. <laughs> These things look like they were done in MS Paint. Yeah, seriously, that's... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Lady, your third <laughs> eye is slightly <laughs> offset, I must say. What the hell? <laughs> that oh wasn't god, centered at all. Tonight. Alright, so how do we play this game that we play? Why is that freaking Joker <laughs> there again? Who is he? Why is he there? <laughs> Seriously, it is never fucking ex explained. He's just there. And they actually expect you to think, oh well that makes sense. <laughs> no, Someone it was doesn't. Really proud of their character. Is uh and <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I made this clip art. Okay, we'll use it. The DA shows up. Hey, if you are a computer player and not actually bound by the rules of physical movement, you can move this fast. Let's go on a magical journey. Can't wait. Wait, holy shit. Oh the bubbly five-year-old with pink hair and her giant pig is supposed to represent the lovers. I'm not touching that with an 11 uh, feet pole. I'm playing as Justice. Her pig is facing the wrong way. So what you're saying is more good decisions in the character design. Yep. And let's head door for the goal. Oh boy. Collect the fire. Looks like you're moving pretty quick. Yeah, you're an awful lot faster in this one than you were in the old ones. What the hell? Oh god, what? Maybe this one you to get the game done faster. Whoa. Everything just exploded. And... I wonder what that meter is to <coughs> power up. Special stage. I don't know. Whoa. Okay, this is interesting. It's our board game. The Japanese really love that for some reason. Making things into part board game for whatever reason. They do it all the time. I played like 15 of those bloody games on various systems. Apparently, they've never played Monopoly and shunned all board games. <laughs> Monopoly isn't really a big thing. They tend to play the game of life, though. They're completely obsessed with the game of life. What? Well, I thought see. that game was boring when I was eight. Well, you know, the I Japanese are really big on the whole planning I your life from the outset thing, so it suits them perfectly. I always loved playing the game of life when I 
was younger and always getting the split level house. The one that was broken in half by an earthquake. <laughs> that was your goal, basically, growing up. You wanted to live in a house like that. Yeah. Everyone said it couldn't be done. I showed them wrong. Whatever. Candyland supremacy. Wait, I just say that out loud. <laughs> oh god. I'm not even going to touch that with a 20-foot pole. Also, I like that these things actually drop down in sets of, like, 20. But they don't automatically pop. No, you have to grab one and put it back in the exact same space. And then they pop. Why? Yeah, I'll just be sure you're paying attention. But it makes no sense. Evil crow. I, mean, I don't know. I am complaining about Japanese puzzle games. Listen to my opinion. Well, I guess while we're complaining, I hate this game's audio so much. Yeah, imagine sitting in an arcade and having like 20 people play this game on various machines around you. Is there a high mortality rate of Japanese arcade owners? Seems like there it would be. It wouldn't surprise me. The funny thing is that I, from what I've seen of watching Game Center CX, it seems that most arcade owners tend to get really old for some reason. And I'm... wait, I didn't even get to move. What the hell, Crow? Why you just gotta be a dick? That's how they roll. Oh. Did you roll a zero on the imaginary dice? Maybe. I don't know. You can't actually see the dice, so... Still, if there's one thing I can't complain about, it's the tempo, because goddamn, this game on most other systems is horrendously slow, but here we actually have some pretty decent movement speed, which is just pretty much my only major complaint in the older ones. Outside yeah, they... of the music and the graphics <laughs> and pretty much everything else, the game Yeah, the game looks like... fun, except for uh, uh, everything that's not the gameplay. <laughs> Yeah, well, the basic game works. I mean, there's a reason they could make so many of them. Well, yeah, they basically knocked off Puzzle Bobble, except affixed your reticle so it just aims forward. Mm -hmm. God damn, they're speeding up. Pretty obvious that they're not happy that I was actually winning for a while. What? You only put in a quarter? We'll not stand for this. Yeah, surprisingly, you he played your money's worth, game. child. Know your place. Oh no, you don't. Oh. Wait, you can actually cross over to the other side of the screen by walking. Huh. Well then. I learned something new today. Yay. Give it one more shot. Wait, seriously. Have you seen how freaking big that map is? This freaking story no. mode goes on forever. 19 spaces. It says. Of course, it makes me morbidly curious to see what's actually at the end. Probably an unwinnable boss. That's how they I get you. Yes. Yeah, you're both right. And suddenly they all exploded. Huh. Oh no, I landed on a scar- wait, what? 
But wait. Wait a minute. I only got to move once. Oh no. <laughs> 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 I'm going to have to fall back on my classic expletive here. Seriously, just bitch tits. Oh, this game is great. <laughs> God damn it. I mean, I'm never going to play this game, but it's great. <laughs> Trolled hard is my only comment. <laughs> Let's hope you don't roll on this. Well, the thing is, apparently it's based on how well you do in the actual level, which means that... Oh. Yeah, you see, it says one space is down there. So <laughs> I'm going to be, I'm going to be continuously hopping... Oh, hey, okay, it doesn't do anything the second time, thank god. Thank god. I seriously thought that I would be stuck there forever until I lucked out to some stupid combo. Jeez. Congratulations, you unlocked Limitless Mode. Looks like it got longer. <laughs> Welcome to in true infinity mode. You will never sleep again. They will not let you leave the arcade either. <laughs> you just have to keep feeding the machine money. Beg for mercy. The arcade operator is behind you with a gun pointed to your head like, I didn't see you finish this game yet. You know what? I think that's enough magical drop. Like, seriously. <laughs> yeah, okay. Way more yeah. magical drop than necessary. <laughs> and all will be forgiven. Well, that was mighty high paced, if nothing else. Yeah, the gameplay yeah. actually looks fun. I mean, if it wasn't for everything else. <laughs> I mean, the funny thing is that pr the previous games, especially the one on the Neo Geo Pocket, were incredibly fast, but your little clown guy moved so incredibly slowly that you b literally had no chance to do anything. It didn't matter how good of a player you were, that little asshole basically took one step every half second, and in two seconds the entire screen was filled. But here you can actually move at the same pace as the game. So you can, you know, play. Sort of helps. 